Good afternoon and welcome to the Imps Ting Podcast Show with me, Cornell B, live and direct, back again. And today, I, Cornell B, is doing a video on why Lincoln City is going to beat West Ham tomorrow night. And my reaction to it, and also how am I feeling about seeing West Ham coming down to Lincoln City, forward slash to the LNER Stadium. First of all, I want to say thank you very much to the 400 and 47 subscribers who have subscribed to my YouTube channel. Love to get it up to 448. It'll be very, very appreciated. So without further ado, let's get into the video back again. So tomorrow is the big day where us, Lincoln City, are going to have the opportunity and the chance to face West Ham in the third round of the EFL Cup. How does that make me feel? It makes me feel so happier even more than I have ever been happier before in my life. Seeing us Lincoln City have this opportunity is one of the best things that we Lincoln City fans can embrace and take that opportunity. The players can take that opportunity as well. And seeing that makes me even more have a smile on my face. Can we? Why are we going to beat West Ham? Because we can. And despite it's going to be, despite that, it's going to be very interesting to see what lineup David Moyes is going to put out against us. I'm sure West Ham are going to see what lineup they, that what we're going to put out, because this is the biggest game. And I've said it from time that even when we had beaten Notts County, when we had beaten Sheffield United, we put them out. This would be the second Premier League team that we Lincoln City. Was to, was to put out. And, and they are prone to giant killings. And I promise you. Us Lincoln City are going to put the giant killing over West Ham. West Ham fans can come out and say. Oh they're going to smash Lincoln. They're going to beat Lincoln. Of course they've got to be happy. They've got to be confident going into, their, into this game tomorrow night. But what they fail to understand. Is that. When you step into the LNER stadium, you step inside, the atmosphere is not going to be pleasant for you. Because the atmosphere in our ground is electric. Absolutely electric. Because this is one, th one game bigger than the others. It's a real shame it's not on Sky Sports. And they put other games on it, other Carabao Cup games, forward slash the EFL games on there. They should have put ours. But hey, listen, I will be very interested to see what lineup Mark Kennedy goes with. I'll be very intrigued. And we're going to do the same thing for West Ham. Obviously, there's players to watch out for. Your War Prouses, your Bowens, your Innings, your Antonios, your Kudoses. Your yeah, Alvarez's and so on. And I think some of the young stars will obviously get an opportunity in a shot. But I'm telling you this. From an Imps fan perspective. That us, Lincoln City Football Club is going to beat West Ham. We are going to take the game to them. I want to see Lucas Jensen doing what he does best. I want to see them heroic saves once again from Jensen. I want to see him being that super Lucas Jensen in goal. I want to see him putting them crucial saves in and saying, you know what? I just did the impossible over this team. And I'm sure, and Mark Kennedy's going to put his best 11. And if there was any best 11 to outsmart West Ham. Because one or two experience from the Premier League is going to play, is going to play tomorrow night for West Ham. And if there was any stronger team that he needs to put out, if I was Kennedy, I'd go with his team. Jensen, Sorensen, O'Connor, Jackson, Mitchell, TJ Omer because of his best performance, his best performance against Sheffield United. Jaden Brown on the left, although one, one, one part of it would probably would say play Jack Barabas. Because Jack Bar we need Jack Barber's pace to go forward and go down go down the wing. So I think Barber's for me would be the best option. Midfield. The two Ethans in midfield. Although Smith deserves to get a shot. And then on the wing, Rico Hackett. 
fingers crossed Danny Man draw you plays on, on tomorrow night, but I, I hardly doubt it. But never say never. I've seen good and bad events happen, and I've seen players come back and say they'll come back soon, and then they end up being in the team. I'd love to see Jack Vale have a shot too, but he's more going to probably be on the bench and probably come on in the second half and get minutes under his belt and probably, you never know, play um, against Cheltenham Town on, on Saturday coming. Well, I think for me, Hackett, a delicate up front, and Bishop on the left, on the right, sorry. But knowing my luck, I would love to see Mandroyu and Hackett on both wings and then have a delicate up front. That would be a stronger team. But Wednesday night, West Ham, we are going to beat you on Wednesday night. We are going to put you out of your misery. We are going to put the giant killing over you. We are Lincoln City Football Club. You can say that you're going to smash us. You're going to do this. You're going to do that. It don't mean nothing. You're going to witness the, the biggest atmosphere inside the LNER Stadium, full slash Central Bank, tomorrow night. We are going to beat you. So Wednesday night, West Ham. Bring it. Because us, Lincoln City, are going to bring it. And we will be in that fourth round. I promise you that. Thank you so much for watching my video today. See you guys tomorrow. Wednesday night. Lincoln City versus West Ham. West Ham. We're coming for you. Up the mighty imps. Thank you.